Hello everybody. Today I'm going to show you how to download the MP3 converting software onto your computer whether you are using Windows or you are using a Mac. If you go to the Music Genie toolbar and click the drop down box for the download tab and you scroll down to Windows you'll see that you have the option to download a YouTube to MP3 software converter. If you click this button, you should arrive at a page that looks just like this, except there will be a video here in the middle. The reason why the video is not there yet is because I'm currently making it. This works the same way for a Mac. If you're on a Mac, then it should bring you to the same page. Click download now. There you go. Now just to let you know that we are not affiliated with any of these software developers. We only use these pieces of software to help out with the functionality of the toolbar. But we are not affiliated with them and we are not responsible for whatever happens to your computer or what might happen to your computer because of downloading either one of these two pieces of software. So now that we're clear on that, you would first choose the operating system that is appropriate for your computer. Right now I'm going to show you how to install this software on Windows. So you click Windows. It should bring up an entire new tab or an entire new um, Internet Explorer browser. And you'll be sent to a page that looks like this. You would now simply download the software by clicking this green button. Give it a little time. It says your download will begin in a moment. And sometimes you might get a um, notification up here on the top of your browser. If you do, then you need to click this button so that you can download the file. Okay? Click download file. Do you want to run or save this file? You want to run this file. Now it says, do you want to run the software? Yes, you want to run the software. Select the language to English, if you want English. And you should get this welcome page here. You'll click Next. You'll accept the agreement. Of course, you'll read through first. You'll click Next. Once you get here, I want you to pay close attention because this is where um, you need to make a little bit of changes. It's very simple, but just pay attention here. Here they want you to install toolbars and they want you to install uh, the DVD video soft web search as the default search and as the home page. Now I would assume that most of you would not want this. Um, the, the DVD soft toolbar is not that great of a toolbar. I've tried it already. You could take my word for it or you could install it. It's totally up to you. But I highly, highly recommend that you uninstall all of these going from the bottom, unchecking every box all the way up to the top, and clicking next. Now you're ready to install. Click install. and you're all finished. If you would like to launch the free YouTube MP3 converter, then keep this box checked. If you don't, uncheck it. I'm going to launch it. Click Finish. And here's what it looks like. It will bring you to a page where you are able to download other DVD soft products 
Now this is totally up to you. Um, you could download the entire studio if you want, but I would assume that most of you would not need all of that. It's a pretty big download and most of it is going to be pretty useless. So, If you would like to know how to operate this piece of software, then please go to the downloads button and there will be a video tutorial um, placed in the drop down box here. Now I'm going to show you how to install the YouTube to MP3 converter on a Mac. The first thing you're going to want to do if you're on a Mac is click this download for Mac link. It will open up a new tab and you're going to click this download now button. Once this download is complete, you should get a box like this. The first thing you're going to want to do is drag this icon over into your applications folder and drop it in. Open your applications folder and find the icon. At this point, the icon image is not